say good morning. Good morning. Happy to have you around. Yeah. Can you introduce yourself? Um, I'm Matushi Mubananwa. I'm Namibia's youth representative at COP. I am a member of Nayore, which is the Namibian Youth on Renewable Energy. I'm also an intern at HGF Energy. So how challenging was it to be a youth representative of your country at the COP27? I wouldn't say it was necessarily challenging. I would actually say it was an opportunity, not something I would say as challenging, but an opportunity for me to acquire knowledge and transfer that knowledge to my fellow youth. Um, seeing the African Union sponsored me was not necessarily a, such a challenge, so I wouldn't call it a challenge. Thank you. Well, I'm happy to have you here, Thank thanks you. to um, this uh, sponsoring. Yes. Back home, what will you say to the other youth about the COP27? What is your take off? What have you learned? And how can you implement that um, in your country? I would implement it as with the fellow youth, starting with the fellow youth, by taking the knowledge I've acquired here at COP and transferring it to them as in holding conferences or oh yes, small, small gatherings that we can try and tackle communities that don't have the knowledge on what's happening and see how we as youth can have synergies out there, but first starting at a local level. So having effective implementation would rather be trying to first teach them and let them understand what is happening, why, what is happening and how we can also contribute to climate change as Namibian youth. Yes, so let's say for the Great Green Wall that I've recently, um, uh, the knowledge that I've learned from the Great Green Wall here, I can, with the connections I've also made, these are type of synergies I can make and also bring back home. Yes, ma'am. Just one single thing about what you have learned before leaving you. What I've learned is the amount of connections one can make and seeing that collectivism is much more important than individualism as in you as an individual cannot change the world. You need to work at a local level with your group starting with because there's a famous quote that says charity begins at home. So you need to be able to work with your locals at home and then lead to forming synergies. So this is one of the most key and important things that I've learned, that in order to combat climate change, we as youth, we as a people, need to come together and be of the same mind and vision. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for having me.